Hi everyone and welcome back. So in this video we are going to understand the mocking uh, and we are going to use the existing example of the form. Let's say we are writing this form right and once you are clicking onto the submit button we want to call an API and, and want to test it what happens like how to mock this API call for the test cases right. So here we are going to create one folder which is API and inside API we are going to create one method api.js let's say and what that api.js will do is api.js okay I'm typing something else api.js and remove this directory which I accidentally created okay now what we want to do here is we are going to have one simple method is const register user and actually we don't have an API call we are just defining the method and here you can actually make your API call here we are just doing console.log hello and we are going to export this a particular We can just simply do is export const so this is a simple our method right register user and we are exporting it this can be your api call and here you are doing some async stuff by passing the data and here you are getting the the data which is being passed by the form like the username password and all okay now what we are going to do is login form will import this API import API register user API from and we are going to get it from API api.js and here we have register user and we are just going to call register user and then submit and here we can pass an object right and there we can pass email is email and password is this now this is our component this is how our component looks like when you click on to the submit button uh, and you have entered the email and password then it is going to call this register user method from the api module okay so when we are writing the test cases now how can we mock this particular thing that is very important thing otherwise rest all things are same here nothing fancy we are doing so what we need to do is we need to use just mock utility okay we are already importing the login form so here we can say is just dot mock and what we are mocking api.js so here we are going to the api and from the API there is the API file this we are trying to mock okay and we are importing the API stuff also API import register user from import everything as an API let's say everything as API from API port slash API okay and here we can say API dot register user equal to just dot function okay we have assigned just dot function and we can also add a mock implementation and all for now what we want to test is once user is submitting button so this is the login form everything is correct button is enabled here now here we are clicking on to this button expect on submit to have been called we don't need to mock it right login form when you click on to submit we are not passing anything in the props so just remove this login form and user click on to the button on submit now here we can just say is because currently the submit button is disabled so this has not been called api.register user 
can also try the same thing to have been called zero times that is correct but when you have, you have entered the value in that particular case api.register user have been called one time right uh, because your submit button is enabled you click on to it if you look into your original component definition you are calling handle submit on the on submit so handle submit is doing is it is calling register user which is coming from the api so whenever you click on the button this should have been called and we are already mocking it now api.register user is a just mock function that means we are spying on to this that means whenever the api.register user is getting called whenever you click on the button this should have been called one time now we can check this this is the previous example both the test cases was for fast okay this helps us to understand how we can mock a particular module because just provides you can even mock the axios or any other third party module here we are mocking this particular module and here we are, have assigned so inside api we have only one method but there can be a number of methods available here like register user sign up sign in and you can mock all of them so one is passing this is good so we can see this is getting called right and we can also do a lot of other things api dot register user to have been called and all to have been called times to have been called with this should be a method to have been called with to have been called with because we are also passing the argument if there is an email and password that means this method is being called with that particular object and if i try this i'm not sure if it will work this test case will fail because this is getting called with some other value which is email and password so let's see if this is going to fail or and you can see this is not an empty object this is the object which we are getting passed right so we can just pass this we can can make our test one more assertion we can add that this is getting called with this particular object and now this will also pass you already know that register user we are passing the form values which is email and the password and we have already entered these values so this will make sure that when user click on the submit button we are passing the exact same value to the form submission to the apis one is failing something wrong let's check okay we need to save it again while it was running the earlier code and i saved it now so this is how you can actually mock a particular file particular so just provides us a different ways to mock a particular class component i mean class component is nothing but that is a es6 module you can mock it and then individual methods by running the component by rendering the component we can check if this particular method has been called has been called how many number of times has been called with all these things we can test so this is nothing but actually a spying on a particular method by doing this particular thing so this is the module and i am spying on to the register user and when you click on to the submit button we can check if register user has been called has been called how many number of times has been called with a particular argument okay uh, this is all this is how we can do the mocking of modules